ThePokeGateCapital.com is the official sponsor of the MLPB. What's cracking you two? My name's Brody, team leader of the Ecryptic Entes, and welcome back to the MLPB Season 2, Week Number 3, where I'll be facing off against Andrew and the Kyoto Klefkis. So, this week we're going to be cracking into three packs of Roaring Skies. So, and as per usual, we have the competitive pick. So, my competitive pick for this week is Swellow. It is a regular rare. Um, it's number 71 out of 108, as you guys can see. I've written it on my pack bag, so there's nothing on the front. It's just, just that one there. So, let's start busting into... Let's rip the seal, and let's get into it. Let's um, start this pack battle off. So, um, be sure to check out Andrew's side of the battle by clicking the link in the description of the video. Um... At the end of this video, so we can compare pools and see who got the better pools. But um, for you, uh, those of you who don't know how a pack battle works, um, it's one point for a reverse rare, two points for a, ho a holo rare, three points for an EX or a break. Obviously, we're opening up Roaring Skies today, so there'll be no no break cards in this one. But then we have four points for a full art and five points for a secret rare. And yeah, so um, for this, for the my competitive pick. Uh, being the regular rare swallow, th if I pull this one, it'll be worth three points. Okay, so even if we manage to get it and it's like a dud pack and it's not that great a pull, we'll still get some solid points on the board for, for pulling it. But we have a Galay pack art. We've got the Mega Latios, uh, the Mega Galay, sorry. We've got the Mega Latios, and then we've got the Deoxys pack. So I'm just gonna go from Deoxys through to Mega Galade. And let's hope that we can get some solid points on the board today because at this current moment, being week number three, I still have not pulled an ultra rare. Every, um, I think everyone else in the MLPB has pulled one, but myself. But let's see what we can do. Let's crack into this first pack and see if we can get the goods for you guys today. And that is the first code of the video. Hopefully... You guys can get something nice as well on TCGO from that one. But let's get this camera all nice and central. Awesome. So we got Gligar, Meow, Spiro, Natu, Shuffet, Unpheasant, a Manetric, Trainer's Mail, a Reverse Rare Duskox. Uh, Dust so that's one point on the board. That's a good way to start it off. And our Rare is... A Skarmory regular rare. See, I was going to pick Skarmory as my competitive pick purely because Skarmory likes to show up in all my all my openings. But anyway, it's got a call for family and blow through. But anyway, cool. We got the reverse rare, so there's one point. That is not a bad start. We we aren't going scoreless in today's opening. That is a good thing. That is a good thing indeed. So we got the Mega Latios um, pack card next. There is the second code for this one. Three, one, two. And hopefully we can get an Ultra on the board because I just have not had the best of luck in this MLPB season yet. But we've got Shuppet. We've got Tropius. Tranquil. Revive. Dratini, that one is just a common reverse. And our rare is a <laughs> Talonflame regular rare. My luck is just terabad. It is so bad. Um, but this is Talonflame, 130 HP, has Grand Loop and Brave Bird. Not bad art. It is not too bad at all. Let's have a look at it. So it's like Talonflame hanging around the water, which is a little bit strange considering it is a fire type, but it's dangerous. Living recklessly. But anyway, we've got Mega Glade pack art. Let's see if we can pull the goods from this pack today and get more than one point on the board because oh, I'm a little bit worried. If we have one point, that is pretty much GG. That is game to Andrew today, I would say, because Andrew has been pulling the goods all season. And I wouldn't expect it to stop now. I would not expect it to stop now. Okay, so we have Dratini, Cascoon, a Halucha, Wingull, Inkay, Rayquaza Spiralink, Tranquil, Gliscor, 
Just a reverse uncommon electrode. And then we have a hollow Jirachi. Shout out to Sleepy. Sleepy Jirachi. But yeah, we got Jirachi with D Diminutive Desire and Doom Desire. It is nice art. And the hollow, hollow pattern on that card is just awesome. It's just so, so shiny. But that does make three points on the board. So let's um let's have a quick recap for this one. Actually, before we do that, let's have a look at what um what we pulled the most in today and what could have been our best competitive pick. So I'll just have a quick flick through here. So it looks like we pulled two NKs, which could have been two points on the board. And I think that might have been two Minetrix as well. But anyway, yeah, so Inke could have been a good choice for today's um, today's opening. But regardless of that, we do have the Reverse Rare dust, uh, dust Ox. And then we have the Hollow Jirachi. So that makes three points. So be, sh um, be sure to let me know what you guys think of this Jirachi art. I think it is nice. It is very cute. Um, and the Hollow to go in the background really makes the Jirachi pop. So yeah, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of that. Um... But yeah, be sure to check out Andrew's um, side of the battle by clicking the link in the top of the, of the description or by clicking the link that I'll leave on screen now for you guys to have easy access to go, just quick access to go check out his video. But yeah, be sure to drop a like on the video if you guys enjoyed. Um, let me know in the comment section below about that Jirachi. Subscribe if you're new to my channel and I'll see you guys in week number four or my next Pokemon trading card game opening. Thanks for watching. Peace.